Hello and welcome to Yota's Kitchen. Today I'm going to be making keftadakya. Keftadakya are basically just little meatball appetizers. Uh, so they're not going to be humongous like you might be making if you're making, let's say, um, meatballs and sausages like I did. But this is going to be a little smaller because, again, it's made for uh, as an appetizer. So here I have one and one-third pound of ground beef. It was 73% lean, 7% fat. I have two tablespoons of water, one egg, two tablespoons of ketchup. I like ketchup in mine. Uh, I have a f uh, one eighth of a cup of um, breadcrumbs, one eighth of a cup, maybe a little bit less of uh, parsley. This is a uh, very finely chopped uh, onion, which was uh, half of a small onion. Then in this bowl, I have a half a teaspoon of salt, one um, fourth teaspoon of black pepper, and a half a tablespoon of oregano. And then here I have three, excuse me, two uh, garlic cloves minced. And then I have flour. I'm going to be rolling the meatballs in flour. And I'm heating up my pan, which I am going to line with olive oil. And when I get to that stage, I'll be back to show you what I'm doing next. Thank you. Hello and welcome to Yota's Kitchen. I just wanted to show you where I was in the process. So I mixed all my ingredients together. I made sure that they were blended really well. And then I rolled them into little meatballs, as you can see right here. My pan is still warming up, and I am just going to put a little olive oil in there. And then... Not too many meatballs in there. I'm going to be filling that up, but I'll be back to show you that next step when I get there. Thank you. Hello and welcome to Yota's Kitchen. So I wanted to show you the process of my kefiradja. So half of them, as you see, I've turned over. They're brown, and the other half are not. So I'm just going to wait until all of them are turned around and cooked and then I'll come back and show you what they look like. Thank you and thank you for watching Yota's Kitchen. Hello and welcome to Yota's Kitchen. I just wanted to show you my keftedagya. So this is the end result. Um, they came out really nice. I tasted two of them and I'm just going to open one up for you just so you can see it. So really nice and soft and perfectly cooked inside so just make sure you brown all sides and in the Greek tradition we either have them warm or we can have them so meaning you just cook them and now you're serving them or more times than not they're cold so they'll give it to you as part of the appetizers so you can have let's say taramosalata or you can have um, let's say hummus, they might put all that stuff depending on what you order if you go to a restaurant or if uh, if you're in a home, you know, whatever it is that they made. Uh, but thank you for watching Yota's Kitchen and I hope you try my recipe. Let me know what you think. These are absolutely delicious. Like I said, I had two. So you make them, you taste them, and then you tell me what you think. Thank you very much. Have a great day.